Live look at the battleship New Jersey this noon. The Big J is marking a major milestone today, and military heroes are being honored. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Jim Donovan. There's a celebration along the Delaware waterfront for the battleship New Jersey. It's the 80th anniversary of the ship's commission into the U.S. Navy. That's where we find CBS News Philadelphia reporter Nikki Dementri. Good afternoon, Nikki. Hey, good afternoon, Jim. Now, that celebration and what organizers tell me is a celebration of remembrance, but also a birthday party here at Battleship New Jersey. It's still going on behind me. Right before we left, I should say, veterans were taking their turn up at the mic and sharing their stories. The first veteran to talk was a World War II veteran, 99 years young, and he shared his memories from serving in World War II. Now, I want to show you what it looked like a little bit earlier. As I mentioned throughout the ceremony, veterans, officers, and the like from throughout the battleship's lifetime spoke. Now, the New Jersey served during World War II, the Vietnam War, and Korean War, among other conflicts. It's called the most decorated Navy ship still afloat today. Memorial Day, our, our most solemn holiday, recommend, uh, recognize the people that gave all is coming up uh, next Monday. So uh, as a veteran myself, I'm, it's very important to have these veterans here. So we have a veteran of each decade of the battleship service speaking here today, which is fantastic. We may not ever have that again. Yeah, it's very special to be here and hear those stories and those memories now ahead of this ceremony. There were new banners that were unveiled honoring our nation's heroes along the promenade. Now back here at the ceremony, um, it will last into the noontime and then there'll be some cake and refreshments to celebrate the 80th commissioning year of Battleship New Jersey. But for now, live in Camden, Nikki Dementri sending it back to you in the studio, Jim. Thank you, Nikki.